Hi YouTube, this is Tara and welcome to my channel, okay? I got to start that over. Um, this is my um, beauty bakery and this is the box, okay? And the products that were inside <laughs> is this brush, okay? Okay, and it says a foundation brush. Look at that. It's nice, right? Pretty. nice and soft it was free with my order so what did I order I ordered enchanted jelly okay this is the name oh god this is the name of it okay and this is it on my bottom lip <clears throat> Okay, see that? It's like the Ju the new Juvia's place. Um, and if you're interested in my look, you can check out my Get Ready With Me that I did earlier today and post it. Um, and this is the perfect time to try this lip gloss on. Because my lips are pretty clean and I don't like to get my wand dirty. So you know the Juvia's Place new uh, new gloss? Um, not the gold one. I ha and I have those um, too. Electric and the other one is called something else. That's what it's like. And I also have a gloss from like Morphe. That's kind of like that unicorn, yeah, like that unicorn ir iridescent type gloss. More purple, blue. Okay, and so this is, um, this one is called Holy Cannoli. Okay, and this is what this look like. And this looks like it's more of the, um, on the gold side. Like, yeah, like electric. Ooh, and that is pretty. Look at that. I like that. I like both of those. Um, this one could have a little bit more pigmentation, but I'm in my 40s, so you really don't want teenage, high school, teeny bop, prom queen, nightclub um, look. Okay, at this age, and let's just mix both of those together. But I like that one, I really like that one. So, yeah, if you're interested, and in, this is like the best wing that I've ever done in a long time. And some, of course, I've been lying down, and some of my makeup has come off, and things of that nature. These are my pores. Say hello, people. These are my pores, and I've been keeping my face clean regularly and things of that nature, trying to see if these um, blemish scars and spots and pigmentation is going to disappear, um, fade. So, right here and here, my under eye and my eyelids are dark, Okay. So let's bring you back out. Yeah. See, had I left it like that, you probably wouldn't have gotten the opportunity to really see the pigmentation in the lids. But these, um, this this whole makeup look besides the gloss, I've already posted the video from earlier today. And these two, the eyeshadows are um, from Morphe. And um, they are 
they were trios, um, a, a nude collection, and a smoky collection. And um, they were $4. And so here's Morphe's um, Talking Flirty. And it's 18 shades. Okay. Morphe is just... Morphe is just selling stuff, okay. Um, Je selling Jeffree Star, selling Jacqueline Hill. I already unboxed my Jeffree Star, um, for Morphe. I forgot the name of that pink palette, it is called, um, Morphe X Jeffree Star. I already unboxed that and showed it. I have not used it. I would have to use that on the weekend when I'm doing like makeup on the weekends because I can't take that to work because that's too big. But the two Morphe palettes that I um, put on and use today for review, I love those. And those are the perfect size palettes to take to work and just to have in your bag just in case you have to... Um, you know, touch up anything just like this palette here. I've already unboxed this. You want to see this palette? Go to my Ipsy, you can go to my Ipsy bag unboxing, the add on or the pop up unboxing. So let's look at these beautiful. So, I'm not going to swatch them because, um, you know, I, I keep saying that unless and I'm going to use that, and I'm sorry, I'm out of, out of the frame. Unless and I'm going to use that particular um, eyeshadow for a look that day, I won't be touching it with my fingers to swatch it. I won't. I'm trying to see how can I show you all and tell you what the colors. But you see that you see that medium purple and that lavender. Then down below it starts pinks, marves, burgundies, and go over to the same. Then it starts into um, the browns, and then down got the pink shimmer last, and then there you have some kind of this color here, this nice little whatever color that is. Then you go pink, then there's the brown at the bottom. Then there's another neutral color, then like a peach and um, like a caramel down at the bottom, orangey color. Then you have this really light color, this shimmer, and it's pink. Now, um, <clears throat> so I won't be swatching. And I know some people will swatch, um, and at least swatch a couple of them, but I'm not going to do that until I get ready to use it. So, ho hold on. Okay, thank you for holding. So, I'd rather put you on hold while I put things back in this proper place instead of when you watch me struggle to put it back. And so... Something else came. It says. Oh. Also with this Morphe. I had a contour brush. So I'll show that to you too. Right here. This is the contour brush. Right here. And I really like the way my makeup came out today. I really do. Um, my makeup always uh, rub off on this side because my wig, my hair is always rubbing it off. But it stayed on today thanks to the um, Urban Decay um, eyeshadow primer that I have on my eyes. It stayed on. It. You don't have to buy that P. Louise for like $15 if you don't want um, but Urban Decay is just about the same price, but you can just catch them on sale. I caught the P. Louise on sale 
because um, Morphe was having a sale. So I do have the P. Louise, and I think I have it in Roma 2. Or was it Roma 4? No, it's Roma 2. I should have got Roma 1 because I have very, very dark eyelids. And so that helps the color pop. So I bought this Milk Hydro Grip Primer that a lot of influencers talk about. So uh, this is what it looks like. I have a primer that I'm using right now. I'm using my Candy Yum Yum that I bought from Walmart, which was like $4 and some change. And I'm using my um, Benefits Pour Primer, Professional Primer. So everybody raves about this. Um, I wanted to buy this from the Boxy Charm pop up. Um, but. It was sold out. So I still was able to go under because I am a sus I, I'm a s I have a subscription for boxy charms. So I was able to go under the tab promos and discounts or promos and coupons. And they still had a tab where I can get like 20% off of this when i buy it on the pop-up it's like 80 percent off but i got it for 20 percent off and i'm i'm good with that um also right here milk and these are the foundation now these are going to be too dark for me i can tell you that now um But this is the one that I will probably try, most likely. But it's probably going to be too dark. Because most foundations, they oxidize once you put them on your face. That means it's, it changes colors. So, I was told that if you put makeup on your face and it looks ashy, then it's too light. If you put makeup on your face and it looks muddy... Um, then it's too dark. Okay. See, like this foundation right here is my Julius Place Burkina um, 310. And I also bought Gabon, a uh, Gabon 300. Gabon is a little bit on the warm side, but that's okay. But this, this Burkina, this is just like the, um, what is the primer? The, um, Il Maquillage, just like the Il Maquillage 320. It's darn, it's darn a perfect. You you almost can't tell I have it on. Now, of course, I wear a mask all day. So, if my foundation and my makeup is constantly rubbing off, that's why I wear my liquid matte lipsticks under my um, mask because they don't rub off as much. But it doesn't rub off on my forehead because I don't wear a mask up here. Um, my hair kind of rubs it off a little bit on this side, but you can still tell. I knew, I knew that that Burkina was, um, I knew that was going to be my joint. I knew it. Something told me that that was going to be it because it was always sold out and I could not purchase it to try it. Okay, yeah, so I have the 10G GL Cinnup Artistry Palette and the 3B Pure New Eyeshadow Palette, which is the three shades, the trio. And then I had a 3A Deep Smoky Eyeshadow Palette, which is a trio. So I've already showed those, I believe, in another video. Um, I used the new in the deep today. So, I hate to do that. That's a waste of product. But when you're swatching, that can't do. Now, this is the part I don't like. 
because you see the glitter that's still on my lips so I'm just going to take a little alcohol because I can't find my Vaseline and wipe plus the alcohol is going to dry for what I'm about to do next. Now, I have already. It's something's missing. Okay. <clears throat> I have already swatched or put on. Um, doing the get ready with me the electric gloss from Julia Place. This is the lip pencil in Scorpio. Okay. And I just have a feeling that I'm going to need it. And um, hmm. That's pretty. I also thought that I ordered cola. So with my first order that came, the electric, the order for the electric, uh, I didn't get my Scorpio pencil. And it clearly said Scorpio. Don't know what happened. I just chalked it up to the game. Said, hey, they getting, uh, Lots of orders. They've been bombarded. You know, I contacted Juvia. Never had a customer service issue before. First time. I don't know my what my um other order from Juvia. I ordered that uh, the Walu. Palette. I didn't do that right. But we at home. We ain't going nowhere. And you see how um I kind of got the liner on here from rubbing it on my pencil. Now tomorrow or whatever other day that I'm going to use this pencil. I could just do it just like that. You see that? I, I can just rub it on there. Now, I don't like the fact that I have gotten it all over like that, even in the middle, because it's going to make it hard for us to see the shade that I bought um, in. It's a mauve moment. But I also have... No, I'm not going to show you it's a mauve moment. I've already did that one. Um, okay, I'll do it. I did it's a mauve moment with another pencil. In fact, I think I did it with it's a mauve moment. I was kind of disappointed. Cause I was like, mm mm. And this is what it looks like. This is how much is in here. Okay. And I want to be Marv and nude, but I think I'm more peachy. The brown nudes are not going to work for me either. Okay. It's a mauve moment. It's a mauve moment. Okay. I, just the part I hate. I got to take it off and waste product. <laughs> so... So, 
hold on. It's alcohol. Because I can't find my um. Don't try this at home. I don't care if the liner doesn't come all the way off. I do, but I don't. Um, I don't know where my cotton balls are and things like that. <laughs> so that's why I'm being ratchet and ghetto. Trying to take off product. And I don't want to use okay. Where's my Vaseline? You know what? I don't want to get it on here either, but this is a chapstick. Y'all know I'm always trying to. I have to find my new toothbrush. Every now and then you have to switch up. Okay. So now we're going to take our pencil. You remember what I told y'all I was going to do? I was going to use that product. You see how I used it? Yeah. So, with that, um, it's a mauve moment. I never did get my Scorpio pencil. So, it's on the way. Hmm. Okay. I'm going to tell y'all something. So this one right here is called Me. So, I think this is from the peach line. Okay, somebody is speeding or something. So, is this the peach or the brown? This is how much in there. And it's called me. Okay. Okay, so it's a mauve moment in me and Scorpio. So I'm waiting on my other Scorpio pencil, but I think I also ordered cola. Isn't that the name of the brown? Because people were saying that would be that that that's pretty good for um if you want a dupe or need a dupe for Mac um chestnut. But I order BFF4 
from ColourPop because I also heard from the Plastic Boy who does makeup here on YouTube and he's pretty good. Can you all tell the difference from this eye and this one? How my makeup is just coming off and it's only because of the hair. So you, what you think? What do you all think? Me. I could never wear neither one of these lipsticks without a liner i would definitely not i i could never wear them without a liner i will always have to wear them with a liner and my goal is to find a lipstick that a nude that i can wear without a liner and i think the one next to cola i think it's called toffee um next to um is it called cola the darkest one in the brown um, the one before it is toffee. I think that may be my nude. But I like this. I like it. It feels good on my lips. Now, I will have to wear this on the weekends only. Because of the mask that we have to wear during the quarantine. Okay? Um... Uh, this will rub off easy look at all that product that I'm wasting okay so next Um, this one is called It's Electric. I've already swatched this. Already. But I'm going to do it again. This was the first gloss that they had in the glass that I said I was going to purchase. Hmm. Um... Let's see. This is what it looks like, you know. Um, so come back. Okay. You see all this glitter? So, and y'all know, I am hating. To, to swatch this because mm. I gotta take it off. Mm. And I can't, I can't be wasting product because I'm getting ready to go on to nobody. I um had some money and I spent it. All on makeup, not stopping to think. Um, the tax free and not just the tax free. Not just tax free, honey. How about the um Thanksgiving and Christmas sales are coming up? And you know everybody's gonna be having Thanksgiving and Christmas sales because can we may not be able to go in the mall. This is the new one, okay, and the new one is called so glaze so glaze and the gold one was called electric so mm. okay yes it's, it's a little pinky oh my god so so mm. oh My daughter is here. Hold on. 